balcony, so now I know why. That's insane. Okay, so everybody says you have to get banana bread and it's literally incredible. They told me to get banana bread in Hana, but I didn't. So I'm getting it here and it's so good. to go so we can still go to the beach and eat. Okay, so this beach right by the river place that we went to is called Fleming. I think it's Fleming Beach and they're surfing. This is supposed to be one of the prettiest beaches in Maui. I just got stung by a jellyfish, so I guess I won't be getting in, which is a bummer because this is where I wanted to go swimming. I'll just go to the beach. Baby, you give me ice and fire. Baby, you give me ice and fire. Baby, you give me ice and fire. You're giving me wind and rain. You're some kind of butterfly. Baby, you give me fear that I love. You whip up my appetite. Meet my new friend. There's a line? Yeah. I got coconut pineapple. Coconut macadamia blood sponge. And. to get coffee but then I was so tempted because it was so good last time. I got a latte with coconut milk, one pump of coconut and one pump of almond and then I got a bagel with cream cheese and a side of bacon. I learned kind of a food tip for travel. If you order things like a la carte it's usually cheaper. So for example a breakfast sandwich like let's say a bagel sandwich with bacon and cheese. Literally all it was was bacon and cheese was $13.00. Okay, so instead I ordered a bagel with cream cheese, which was $5, and then a side of bacon, which was only a dollar. So I paid $6 and for like essentially the same thing. I just don't have cheese in it, which I have cream cheese. 
but I'm just gonna eat the bacon on the side, so you're welcome. Okay, we're saying goodbye to my last place, my cute little Airbnb that I really enjoyed. I mean, I had the most literally amazing view. I just, it was really, really perfect. Oh, I'm so sad. Try not to cry about leaving. <laughs> But, um, I think I gave y'all a full tour, like, um, right when I got here, but the girl at the, um, beach that I'm at gave me this, like, browning lotion, and it had sunscreen on, too, but, like, I got so, like, dark just in one day, and I've been here forever. I'm like, why am I just now getting tan? Literally on my last full day. Anyways, we're gonna go find a beach, but I'm saying goodbye to my place. This is... Just be prepared if you ever come to Hawaii, you'll be very sad when you leave. <laughs> uh. Well, I went into the store for sunscreen and I came out with this really cute cropped tank top. Like, look how cute that is. At first I was like, I refuse to buy a Hawaii shirt, but like, that's just too cute. Okay, so this is Baldwin Beach Park. And this was on one of the list of the top Maui beaches. Finally found sunscreen at the gas station. This is not the sunscreen that I like, but it's the only thing they had. Like, you think in Maui I would be able to find, like, a lot of sunscreen, but it actually their choices were very limited at the places that I went to. And then I love these chips, so I'm going to go with my last PB&J that I had. <laughs> Check right before the trip and it's totally been worth it so you should get it if you don't have it yet.